Welcome to Brain Wizard channel. If you enjoy solving amazing puzzles, you have come to the right place. Stay tuned on this channel for more such puzzles. Hi, if you enjoy solving thought provoking puzzles, then here is another interesting puzzle for you. This puzzle requires you to deal with uh, numbers a bit. So let's look at this interesting puzzle, which is pan balance puzzle. In fact, I'm also releasing another video on the pan balance puzzle. So do check that. So the situation is something like this. A trader wants to measure all the weights that is integer value that is uh, from 1 kg to 221 kg using a common balance where weights can be kept on either side of the pans. Wherever you want, you can keep the weights. I mean, you can also keep on the both sides. What is the minimum number of weights needed to measure all the weights from 1 to 1, uh, 221 kg? Now, remember that we can put the weights on both sides of the pan. So this is going to be slightly tricky situation. You can post your answer in the comment section. Now let's look at the solution of this question. If you want, you can pause your video over here in case if you need more time. So let me show you the solution. First, we'll take a weight of 1 kg, so which will obviously be required. Now, instead of taking 2 kg weight, what we can do is we can directly take 3 kg weight because using 3 kg and 1 kg, we can definitely measure 2 kg. We can put 3 kg on left pan and we can put 1 kg on the right pan and we can put some commodity over here. So that commodity will be of 2 kg weight. So yes, by using 1 kg and 3 kg, we can measure even 2 kg. So now what we can do is we can observe some pattern. So the pattern will be something like this. First, we have taken 1 kg. Then you are making double and you are adding plus 1 to that. So it will come out to be 3 kg. Now total weight that we can measure is 4 kg. So we can once again make double of 4 and add 1 to that. So use uh, will the next weight should be of 9 kg. Now using 1, 3 and 9, we can measure all the weights up to 13 kg. How can we measure that? Let's quickly understand. So for example, if I want to measure 5 kg, I'll put 9 kg on left pen and 3 plus 1 on the right pen. And along with that, I can put the commodity. So this commodity will be of 5 kg. Similarly, if I want to measure 6 kg, it will be 9 and 3. And along with 3 kg weight, you can put the commodity and so on and so forth. So here we can observe an interesting pattern. So you can quickly make out the next number has to be 27. Now why 27? Because all these numbers are nothing but power of 3. For example, 1 is 3 raised to 0. 3 is 3 raised to 1. This is 3 raised to 2. Then 3 raised to 3. The next number will be 3 raised to 4 and so on and so forth. So that will be 81 kg. Now if I observe this total will come out to be 121 kg. Right. So my next weight, the sixth weight, because this is first, second, third, fourth and fifth. We have already used five weights. The sixth weight can be of 243 kg. That is 3 raised to 5. Or since we just need to measure up to 221 kg, we can just take the remaining kg as the our next weight. So this will be our sixth weight and total weights required will be of 6 kg. So I really hope you have understood this. Please hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Also, share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more interesting puzzle updates.